What's good, CH gang? Hashtag curly head gang. I'm back with another. Welcome back. <clears throat> Welcome back to my channel, curly head gang, aka. Welcome back to my channel, CH gang. Hashtag curly head gang. It's your girl, Queen, and I'm back with another video today for you guys. And so before I get started with this video, I just want to talk to you guys about some things really quickly. If you're one of my little subscribers, which is probably only three people, but you'll notice that if you watch all my videos, you'll notice I've been posting videos every day for the past three days. And that's because school's about to start, so I'm trying to get you guys on track to watching my videos because I'm gonna it's my senior year and I'm gonna be posting a lot of videos and I don't want you guys to miss the content. So I'm gonna be posting every day for a week. So next Saturday will most likely be my last day that I'll have a video uploaded and posted for you guys. So I'm posting every day. And so, uh, for a week. After that, it'll be my second week of school and so I'll be more into like my assignments and things like that. And so I'll be posting Tuesdays, Thursdays, Saturdays, and Sundays. So look out for that. If anything changes with that, I'll let you know in my next video. But so, let's get into this video anyways so if you read the title you already know what this video is about today is gonna be what's in my purse but since i don't like wear purses and stuff it's gonna be a what's in my wallet anyways so let's get started first thing in my wallet which you already know because i'm wearing it is my lip gloss this is uh by nk makeup it's lip gel with vitamin e and it's in the color clear an old thing of karmic sometimes karmic comes out sometimes it doesn't i really need to throw this away because it's like empty it's i don't know what oh this is my thing from when i had when i was like i took my trip to dc this summer so that was like a receipt or something i don't know but it was for me to keep next gum wrappers and cut up water cut up burger king coupon i'm throwing that away but anyways Next is my hand sanitizer. I keep this on me. I need to get some more because it's about to run out. But I keep that thing on me. This is what I mean when I say I keep that thing on me. Well, this is one of the things I mean when I say I keep that thing on me. Because, like, people dirty. And, like, you be touching a whole bunch of dirty stuff. Like, and you be needing hand sanitizer to, like, save your life. Because people are dirty. Like, for real. So another one of those things that i showed y'all from my trip back oh wait no that's still the first one i just picked it up by accident next is movie tickets this was from when i went to go see toy story 4. i went to go see it with my brothers next my subway uh this is my subway receipt i had got a meatball marinara sub thing the jiggy it was good it was good as i don't know what nail file if you know me you know i'm not bougie but if you know me you know when i take my nails off after i go get my nails done they're long and so but they're very thin because of like my thyroid disease if y'all want to know about that just like comment in the comments and i'll tell you about my thyroid disease and how it works how it affects my skin my hair and my nails and like just my daily life but anyways, so if y'all know, thyroid disease is like you have thin nails. And so my nails be like already thin because the lady be having to cut it down to put the acrylic on, make it stick and stuff. But anyways, so my nails be breaking and I be needing my nail file to keep them intact and in shape and looking nice when I go places. Because I just don't want to have raggedy nails just trying to like touch people and they look down, see a hangnail like, ooh, she dirty. No, this is my nail file. Next, I got this like yesterday or the day before. This is a one dollar off coupon for any Frito Lay product. When I buy one, when I buy any Frito Lay product, I save one dollar on it. After that, this is my old Cash App card. Um, I really sh I'm gonna throw this away because I don't need it because I'm ordering. I'm ordering a new one for my new Cash App account. Yeah. Anyways, after that, this is my AP. Card. 
Next is my last year junior year school ID. This is really, really, y'all. They have me looking stupid. I was really dark, if you can't tell. Look, you see the difference? I was really dark. But that was because I was going any and everywhere, like during the summer, like during the day when it was hot and the sun was out and burning skin. After that, it's my, this, oh, I'm finna throw this away too because I just don't got no money on it like i don't even know i would just be keeping stuff and it don't be having nothing on it like <laughs> i'm a hoarder i'm not a hoarder but like i'm sentimental so like it's gonna be so hard for me to throw this away but i'm just gonna do it next i'm not gonna show y'all but i got my social security card because i don't know i just have my social security card some people do some people don't but i mean i'm about to be 17 like i go places i'm getting jobs i need my social on me i need to keep that thing on me that's another one of them things that i keep on me but out of all that stuff i just showed y'all i'm only putting in my lip gloss back my hand sanitizer my nail file my old school id and uh my social and that frito-lay one dollar off thing so this also when i was gonna see the lion king I keep that stuff because I'm sentimental because I'm with my brothers. I'm sentimental though. Like for real. When I tell y'all I'm sentimental, like I'm the definition of keeping stuff because like because of the memories. Like I be wanting to remember that stuff. And it just be like when like those people gone and stuff like that, you be thinking about them. You be having that to like remind you of the good times. And so that's why I'll be keeping some stuff. Oh, I didn't show y'all my H-E-B receipt from when I was going to get food. Next, this is a dry towel to dry your hands off or wipe your hands off with when you're eating food. I had that from all the way back when I was up in Virginia during my trip to D.C. Because you know the DMV, D.C., Maryland, Virginia. It's like all right there. Let me tell y'all right now. I got a lot of freaking trash in my wallet and I got a lot of receipts. So this is some more Burger King coupon trash from the same coupon. This was from my $1 sewing kit that I had got. And it worked well, but I lost it. I don't know where it is. This was from Beauty Empire. Um, when I had bought that hair dye, but I'm y'all, I haven't dyed my hair yet. Like this is old dye that's in my hair. I'm re-dying my hair and that video is going to be uploaded to my channel whenever, sometime next week, like for a second week of school, either the first week or the second week of school for like regular HISB kids. Anyways, after that, I have from the food market, just another coupon, I mean another receipt, next, a straw trash. Y'all, I don't be liking to just throw trash on the ground like when I'm in public and stuff, like so, I just be putting it in my wallet. Oh, this is when some man had gave me this thing. Anyways, he stopped smoking cigarettes and it saved his heart, something like that. He was telling the story. But he spoke Spanish, so I didn't understand a lot of what he was saying. And he ain't built away food market coupon, throw it away. That's these got to be old because I don't even live over there. Another H E B one for Arizona green tea. Gum trash. A nail. Y'all, this was from that Instagram baddie video. This is the nails that I had on him. I think this is from my pointing finger. Yeah. <laughs> I'm funny. A Jack in the Box receipt. Y'all, I got a lot of receipts up in here, okay? Next, a pen. Because when you go to um, job interviews and you be needing to fill stuff out, you need your own pen just in case they don't have it. You need to be prepared to say, oh, I have my own pen like that's impressive you got your own pen go ahead i see you girl next y'all don't get at me for this don't come for me in the comments for this i got a knife it's real real pretty if you know me and you go to my school lamar high school if you go to lamar high school and you have me for chinese class 
you was already introduced to this but anyways y'all i don't bring weapons to school but anyways so this is the knife i keep this for protection reasons like really i need to feel safe but anyways i wanted the m9 bandit which is a military grade knife i love knives if you know me but like y'all don't but now you know i love knives i wanted the m9 bandit which is a military grade knife it's really really nice it's really efficient at doing its job i'm not trying to hurt nobody but i'm saying i need something for protection because i'm a small person i hate when people call me small but i have to admit when it comes to like the real world i'm small i'm 120 pounds and i'm 5'5 five five or 5'4 five almost 5'5 five five. like literally i'm really 5'7 five 5'8 five but the doctor just don't know that yet they just keep telling me 5'5 five five. like you get in there i wasn't supposed to get no taller than 5'2 mind you look at me now 5'4 five 5'5 five five, five 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 going on five eight like literally but anyway so my pocket knife i don't want to open it for y'all because i don't want to put knives on here y'all i don't want nothing to like ban me or nothing from youtube because i love youtube anyways this is another gift card that i had thrown it away ain't got no money on it this is a card from my mother i'm gonna keep this because she had gave it to me for something then this is my pastor's information for our church I'm going to put this down below because y'all need to come to Mount Moriah Missionary Baptist Church. And when they ask who sent you, say Quillian did. Quillian Haynes, I saw her YouTube channel. And um, she said to come praise the Lord here. Because I did. Go praise the Lord there. That's a good place to praise the Lord. Just an old food stamps card. But we don't get food stamps no more because we don't have... We don't make food stamps money. We make too much money now. But anyways fun card i'm keeping this but anyways a chick-fil-a card i already used all the money on here but i had it i'm gonna throw that away too another gift card with no money on it i'm shameful y'all this is just a shame this was i'm supposed to get um hired at sonic and like i never got hired but anyways this is me as a little girl this is me then this my brother and this my grandpa. We call him Papa Kenny, but that's a picture. I keep that in my wallet too. But that knife, y'all, that's what I meant by when I say I keep that thing on me. But anyways, this video is 16 minutes long and I got some editing. So anyways, thank you for watching me. Um, Show y'all what's in my wallet slash purse and helping me clean it out. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.